what? <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so excited. This place doesn't have an official name, but it's known as The Wall or Nomad View Dispersed Camping. And you can camp here on a cliff overlooking the Badlands National Park for free. You just find an open spot and set up camp. This place doesn't have any amenities that you would expect to find at a campground, but it's been called a top five camping destination in the United States. And now I know why. Oh my gosh, look at that view. Yeah, you could hike down there and I don't know how, yeah, I bet you could go all the way out there. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. I'm walking on the edge of the cliff and these are the Badlands in South Dakota. And man, is this an incredible view. This is just a little bit down the road, but another gorgeous spot. This one here, you could definitely go down there and sit on that ledge. What a view, huh? I mean, seriously, look at this. <gasps> oh my gosh, this is just unreal. Oh, we're not level enough. We're gonna have to rely on some boards. Now, this is a camping spot with a view. And gosh, I have to pinch myself. I can't believe this is real. It looks like I'm on a different planet. Where have you camped that the views have absolutely blown your mind? Let me know. But what else is cool? Look at what I found. There's droppings on the ground. This means there's wildlife that roams around here too. This is so cool. Just can't believe how beautiful it is here. It feels like sand and that's what I think it is. It's not rock up here anyways. I hope that this video does this justice, but I just have a feeling it might not. I hope you can just see how absolutely, incredibly gorgeous this is. Can you see how far down that is? Oh my gosh, look right. Where is it here on camera? Let's see. Right about there, I think. Look, there's a chair. Somebody lost their chair. The chair probably came all the way down from that campsite. All the way down there. It's a long ways down there. The sun is starting to rise. Isn't that beautiful? We spent that afternoon doing some incredible hikes in the Badlands. But later that day, when we got back to our camping spot, we decided to move to another spot. It had gotten crowded in this area, and we hadn't seen any wildlife. Shortly after we got settled in our new spot, 
I happened to peek over the rim, and this is what I saw. There were these four bighorn sheep hanging out just below us. So I walked down the trail that was right in front of our camper to sit there and watch them. Now I was really pinching myself. I had never seen anything like this before. They were all just hanging out, and then this guy walked right in front of me across the trail that I was sitting on. And then he decided to lay down. Okay, fella, now how am I going to get back to my camper? Then I noticed that Tom was watching the situation, and I was relieved because I I was getting a little nervous. There's another one getting close to the trail. I don't want to be in your way. You don't need to take the trail. No. Oh yes, go that way, not this way. Okay, now you're looking at me too. I hope you don't decide to sit down too. I hope you guys just keep moving on. I want to get back to my camper. I don't know if you can hear me, Tom, but I'm a little worried. Ten minutes later. Okay, come on guys, let's get a move on. Woohoo, they left. They seem friendly enough, but you never know. So I'm so glad to be back up here. If you're visiting South Dakota and you love camping with wildlife, you need to check out Custer State Park. It's only one and a half hours away and just as epic as this adventure was. Click on this video right up here right now to see what I mean. <laughs> 